Or I can just put it somewhere. I think. So you're a blogger. Um, I'm trying to. I'm starting actually. Just one day. No, um, I think a month. A month. Yeah. Oh. How was it? Um, it's pretty crazy. It's very demanding. I didn't expect that. Oh yeah. Too much time for the thinking. What content should I put? The editing, everything. Editing, yeah, oh my gosh. Yeah, the editing. Actually, is... no. mm -hmm. Do you vlog too? I'm, I don't want to do it because I remember the time when um, IG was uh, you will do a photo for it just for fun, mm -hmm. just share with your friends. Yeah. And it was not a goal of your life. It was not a work. It was like like. Nobody cares. Uh -huh. you do, but now it's much more commercial, and I think the majority of people understand that it's like a place where you can advertise everything, and then you can sell your time, and like this. Uh -huh. So from this point, I I don't know. I just just think it's too commercial. For me. Yes, actually. Like like for a kind. <laughs> you know, because you expected something something like like. Bounty Island with the palms with the coconuts. And the, it's not so probably, but okay. I Boracay. Why don't you see uh, behind the people? Because it's really crowded. Mm -hmm. So yeah, actually, to not cross the legs because it's important for the balance of the hair. Oh, yeah. Oh, um, some hair can fall on your hands. Mm -hmm. So then the is it okay? Oh, yeah. it's fine. Thank you. So. And you are, you are Filipino? Yeah, I'm pure Filipino. Filipino. Uh -huh. It's okay. So, how long do you stay here in the Philippines now? Around, I'm here in the hub, so I'm for a good around this time. Did you came here for work or just vacation and then you decided to go? Um, I just went for a good here because I have a lot of friends who live here. Um, not only Russians, it's also Filipino, Filipino people are um, which I've met in Europe, majority of them I've met. Um, but this is my first time. I mean, I mean, I've never been before here. I just just said, why not? Mm -hmm. It was so easy. And so far, how was the Philippines? I'm still here, as you see. <laughs> So. I'm not the kind of person who, you know, just like mm, complaining about everything. If I don't like it, I don't know about it. Why should you stay here if I don't like it? Mm -hmm. I really enjoy it because there's a lot of possibilities to travel around, not about the islands. Because I, uh, I suggest you travel outside of Manila, like Palaer, Kasiguran, Nagaita, Palau. Um, La Union, Baguio, uh -huh. and you know, just like there's a lot of different spots where you can stay. J yes. j just it takes around six hours. Okay, to Kasigran, I, I'm trying to get uh, around 20 hours. <laughs> it was really crazy. So, may I ask you to turn your head down as much as you can? Yeah, perfect. So, and I actually okay with the weather, I'm okay with everything. You know. The food. Mm, I think for myself, it's okay. I'm not a big fan of restaurants, restaurants because uh, I'm a kind of... In Russia, we name it like a technologist of food solution process. Mm -hmm. But here it's like a, I'm like an engineer of food solutions. Like I know how to build the fabric. Mm -hmm. which produce different kinds of products. This is my first category. So I know how to cook. I know how to cook the tasty food and this is why I prefer to cook at home. Uh -huh. And also, the, it, I believe you don't like sweet food meal? You know, just 
first time when I came to Philipp, the Philippines, especially to Manila, I just uh, uh, went to the uh, bubble tea store <laughs> and just uh, they asked me, oh, what kind of, uh, what percentage of sweetness do you want? Uh -huh. Regular! So it's impossible to drink this syrup. Yeah. It's like a sugar syrup. I thought that I'm sweet too, but I'm not at all. Not Philippines. Mm -hmm. But I'm a big fan of uh, uh, the shrimp paste. Bagoong. Bagoong. Yeah. Have you tried eating it with mango? I I always eat it with the green mango. Ah. <laughs> It's our favorite. Food. And sometimes my clients who knows that they bring me a small portion of my own because I, they know that I love it. Mm -hmm. So this is why I have a lot of it at home. <laughs> and my helper always, she, she knows that I always need two months in my fridge. Mm -hmm. So usually she bought for a week um, one kilo or two kilos of green mango. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I'm a big fan of Pacao and uh, so the second is uh, Bulalo. Yes, Bulalo. I cook for my partner Bulalo. Oh, it's nice. I think it tasted for us because we really... Mm, it reminds us the... It's uh, like, like a borscht. Uh -huh, borscht. Do you know about it? He, we talked about it. Huh? We talked about it, I and mean, my partner and I, and so, they discussed about the soups that you guys eat in Russia. It's actually easy to cook, uh, I can eat, if you want to cook it for them. Mm -hmm. I can give you a recipe with a very, uh, with the, not notification, uh, with the description uh -huh. about, about each level. Через минут 15 закончим. Через минут 15 закончим. Да. Спасибо. Я it's a funny thing when uh, usually uh, on the English speaking countries people used to speak like the Haglish or Runglish. But it's really funny when the couple <laughs> when the couple speaks on three languages, they became combine uh, they become to combine three languages and how we should call it. Tringlish. <laughs> Tringlish. Okay. Если что, можно сесть здесь сесть. А, да? Да? Окей. Как удобно по-русски разговаривать? Как удобно говорю, когда по-русски? Да, это гораздо облегчает. Но это очень тяжело спичать. Да, да. It's really easy to talk in, in, in Russian language, but it's really easy to speak between two languages when you speak with both of them. And the funny fact in Tagalog, uh uh means yes. Yes. <laughs> in Russian language, it means no. Uh uh. Uh uh. uh, -uh. Like, I remember the, when the Russian client came to our store, and some of the assistants asked her, Do you want to do a treatment? And she uh, replies, uh uh. Uh huh. Okay. Do a treatment. It was really funny. Okay, so. You should put it like here. Actually, I have like a sample of the uh, 
for it. I'm so sorry to eat.